What's up everybody, it's Margo, and today I'm back with another video! Wait a minute, this is the first video. Hi. So, I'm Margo, Margo Winters, and I'm a teenager who loves books, writing, music, and anything related to the creative arts. Basically what I'm trying to do here is start a channel? Right. So, as I was saying, this is an introduction to the channel. I have four main topics that I will be talking about today, and hopefully it goes over well. If this is kind of awkward and kind of rushed, I'm scared, <laughs> and I'm nervous out of my mind. So to begin with, I will tell you who I am. I'm a teenager, a writer, and an aspiring video editor. <laughs> This is, this is, this sounds really stupid, but the whole reason I'm starting up a YouTube channel is both for fun and also because I want to get practice with editing. I want to learn how to do this right, as this is what I plan to do in my career. I plan to be an editor, well, secretly I'm pining to become a producer, but right now, editor's all I kinda got. <laughs> so don't judge me too harshly as this is the first time I'm trying this out ever. I mean, well, aside from a school PSA on kidnapping, but you know. So I have bulleted notes here because I have a tendency to be long-winded and talk a lot. <laughs> Predominantly, the type of content I will be releasing will be related to booktube, and if you don't know what booktube is, essentially it's a community of readers online who like to talk about YA literature, uh, pop culture related to books, TV shows that were adapted and movies that were adapted by books such as uh, Love, Simon was released from Simon vs. the Homo Sapiens agenda, Everything Everything by Nicola Yoon was adapted and people were talking about it and it was huge. And the type of things I will be doing related to booktube are tags, hauls, reviews, shelf advice, all of that, and I will be hopefully bringing some new tags to the table as uh, as they were huge huge a year ago and and so many people were doing them because so many of them were so fresh and new and a lot of people some people still do them such such as great booktubers like Christine Riccio also known as Pull Bananas Books she is amazing she's one of the biggest inspirations for me even doing this in the first place and it's overall just a great community to be in and one that I've wanted to be a part of for a while so <laughs> That's one of the biggest reasons. On to number two. I will also be making spoken word related videos. And if you don't know what spoken word is, spoken word is a type of poetry that's meant to be performed vocally in public on a stage. Well, there aren't any cafes or poetry competition centers here where I live, so YouTube is kind of where I'm going to put it. <laughs> I'm Mason. I'm mainly getting inspiration from button poetry and all deaf poetry on here. Also my two favorite poets in the world, which are Sarah Kay and Shane Koizan. I will also be recording audio excerpts from my novel and other stories that I write. You probably haven't seen me before, but if you have, hi, this is what I look like and this is the first time I'm kind of releasing anything related to my face. I am mainly known on Wattpad and Quora. And if you don't know what Quora is, it's an informational digest that is absolutely fantastic. It's a great community to find and answer stuff. It's just, it's great. And I am so scared. Because the problem is, there's always the chance that this is going to blow up in my face. It might. It just might. This is so awkward. <laughs> oh. Right. Anyway. Continuing. Moving on. Enough with tangents. Number three, graphic design related work. I used to use this term a lot, but I kind of removed it from my social media presence as I feel, I feel like my work is at least decent for what it is. I have always been a self-proclaimed amateur graphic designer and I started working at graphic design and related content about two or three, no, it's technically three years ago because I'm almost 15, so technically three years ago, if, if we want to be accurate. And mainly what I do is, because I'm not the best at traditional art, then again, nowadays graphic design is mainly working with images that, you can, that can be created through Photoshop, and I'm not currently able to use Photoshop, so that's kind of out of the ring for me, even though I do plan to use it in the, in the future. Preferably next year, I plan to start using Photoshop. 
designer, what I do is I create logos, profile pictures, and book covers. I've mostly been commissioned for book covers, although I have been also commissioned for profile pictures and watermarks. Plus, highlight reels of my finest work of the month. And finally, behind the scenes photo shoots. I have an awesome bro named Dominic. He is on Instagram known as Dami's Photography, and he's really good. Whenever I go on a shoot with him, we usually have a lot of fun doing what we do. Usually whenever I am present for a shoot, things are often really laid back and hilarious, and I thought it'd be a nice thing to watch. I mean, it's the type of content I would watch, and I think that's kind of the whole spirit of YouTube is other creators creating what they think would be entertaining. And to me, well, Behind the scenes tomfoolery is kind of hilarious. Number four, writing content. In relation to writing content, I will be releasing monthly vlogs, skits, challenges, and prompts. What I mean by challenges and prompts is that I will make a game out of writing prompts and try and make it fun and entertaining to watch. Uh, when the video comes, you'll understand what it is. In relation to skits, I will be making videos that correspond with things you go through as a writer, such as writer's block, creating characters, plotting, villains, all of it. Overview time! What will be on this channel? Booktube content, spoken word, graphic design, and writing content! <sighs> I think that's it. I think that really is it for the introduction, and the next video I'll do will be the booktube newbie tag which is how you introduce yourself to the booktube community and I think that's gonna be pretty cool. Thank you for watching and make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and leave a comment down below if you have any thoughts to add. Without further ado, let us turn the page on this video and I will see you on the next chapter. Ciao!